Mr Agnew, one minute. Thank you, Chairman. I can think of two instances in my life where well-meaning Western politicians have destroyed the capability of food production in Africa. The first was the country called Rhodesia, where they were actually exporting food to six other countries until Western politicians got involved, got rid of Ian Smith, brought in somebody called Mugabe, who presided over mass hunger. You didn't have to do it. The second thing is ongoing, and this is this extraordinary attitude of the EU and the NGOs it, fun it funds about GM technology and plant breeding. If this technology could have been used in Africa over the last 20 years, a lot more people would have had a lot more to eat. Because if you are forced to use pesticides in, in Africa, you have to transport them, you have to store them, you have to use them safely, you have to keep them away from children. The GM technology would make all that go away. You just don't need the pesticides with that. And yet what do we do? We do everything we can to make it as difficult as possible. One